Hello, hello, and hello, muggles. My name is Abigail Yi, and this is my first mukbang. We have a wide spread of Taco Bell from Taco Bell, as you can see. So let's see what we got. We have the deluxe nachos. It's a new thing. You get it with a drink. There's beans on it. There's no meat because my sister's vegetarian. Wait to the camera, sis. Hey. <laughs> And we got a black bean gordita crunch. We have one of these is a bean burrito and one of these is a beef burrito. We have the chalupa supreme. We have two normal tacos. We got three Doritos Locos tacos, one of them vegetarian. And we have a black bean and, I don't think it's black bean, bean and rice burrito. And to top it all off, we have homemade butter beer. Let's cheers that. Ah! Mm. It's really good. We also got for dessert the little cinnamon balls filled with cream. Super good. And today we're going to be talking about Harry Potter for all you Harry Potter nerds out there. I know I am. No shame. <laughs> and we have a little questions and prompts in our Tri Wizard Cup. All right, so let's dig in. Pick something. This one. I think I'm gonna start with the nacho. Do you wanna do you wanna do the first question? Mm-hmm. I'll put your first one. Alright. So the first question is favorite Harry Potter movie. Hmm. Mine is Order of the Phoenix. Order of the Phoenix? Because Luna Lovegood is so lovely and mm -hmm. magical. And it's it's the like oh poop movie. Things getting mm. serious. Mm. Order of the Phoenix? Hmm? Order of the Phoenix? Order of the Phoenix. Mm. Looks pretty, it's really good. I don't even know you. Nice mm. lukewarm temperature. It's a little soggy. <laughs> but it's really good. So is there any other reason why you like the fifth one? I like the color filtering mm -hmm. of it. Mm -hmm. I just think it's the most mm. palatable for me on, mm. on a... I can watch it a lot mm, without okay. being like, oh my god. That's cool. I think my favorite movie would definitely have to be Harry Potter and you can guess the Half-Blood Prince. And that's a sixth one for all you guys out there who don't know. And why is that? Well, first of all, I think my favorite scene in the movie is when Ron gets, spoiler alert, when Ron takes the love potion that was meant for Harry and he's just in the mm -hmm. loopy daydream world, I think that's one of my favorite scenes. But also, it's not where things turn for the worse, but I think where a lot of things are revealed in the sixth movie that's so crucial mm -hmm. for the rest of the movies and makes so much sense that I think it's just brilliant, honestly. Mm -hmm. mm. I also love the music in that movie. Mm-hmm. Can we talk about that for a second? Mm -hmm. The scoring on um, all the Harry Potter movies is just it's fantastic. Mm. It's amazing. But I think my favorite musical scoring is definitely the third one. Absolutely. Mm. And sorry if you hear random paw on the ground. We have six dogs in our house. <laughs> so welcoming Asia. Asia. Asia, come on camera. Come here. Come, here. come on camera. Yeah, introduce There's yourself. There's Asia. <laughs> you get a prize. Yeah, All right, very go lay down, Bubba. Bye, bye. She's like, really? <laughs> All right, Catherine, go ahead and pick the next one. Mm. It's a very narrow. Mm. That's so funny. Cool. Oh, she's like, what character do you have a crush on? Where do I start? <laughs> um. Ron is just a beautiful character. <laughs> character. Like, mm. Rupert is lovely, Beautiful. but Ron is just, you have to love him. He's just a supportive friend. Ooh, Anya's running in the bushes. <laughs> and, like, gingers. You like ginger? When they're, when they're Ron, I would love to be, like, a Weasley in-law. Mm. You know? All you gingers out there. 
if you're Ronald Weasley, <laughs> what's up, buddy? If you're Ronald Weasley, you win. Yeah. Paul <laughs> going walking home. Oh my gosh, you can see him zooming in the back. <laughs> okay. Mm. But okay. also, mm-hmm. Cedric. Oh man. But come on, it's freaking what's his name? Vampire guy. Yeah, but he didn't like. He was a vampire him. guy until he was after Harry Potter. He also said that he hated Twilight. That sucks. Yeah. Well, oh, he is beautiful, man. I would say you probably know. I, since I was younger, have had oh a great gosh. love for Draco Malfoy. I know. I know. Controversial. Controversial. Oh, he's a dead leader. Whatever. No. no. He's awesome. Hmm. It's just like. I love the fact that he was raised in a pure blood family, like a family like the older pure blood families who really value being a pure blood. He was raised with the mindset he had to marry pure blood, or else he was just trash. Like, could you imagine growing up in that environment? I just think his psychology is so yeah, interesting. The fact that he, at the end, kind of came around mm-hmm. is impressive. Absolutely, and you know, everyone likes a little bad boy, I guess. I love Luna so much. Luna. Mm -hmm. So much. And she's just beautiful. I love her costume choices. Mm -hmm. The way she dresses is really cool. Mm. We love Luna so much. Tonks is... Oh my gosh. Tonks is just so cool. (laughs) We actually love Luna so much. We named one of our dogs after her. Oh my gosh, yes. And she acts. She's just as weird. Mm Mm-hmm. Mm. Maybe you have one of these next? Sure. <laughs> She's just been eating it. Mm. <laughs> okay. Do you have anything to weigh in, Ethan? Mm-hmm. No. Right. We also have my. Both my siblings are here today, but we're just focusing on the caster. Who is hot? I'm really hot. Sorry, I microwaved it. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Ooh, I know which one this is. It's the only thick one I have. What class would be your top pick? Transfiguration, Defense Against the Dark Arts, Charms, Potions, History of Magic, Astronomy, Herbology, or Flying? I think Charms would be a useful one. Mm -hmm. And I would love Herbology. Because I am a Hufflepuff. Oh, yeah, you are. We'll get to that. Also, mm. no, I think those two are my top, but also Transfiguration, having McGonagall. <gasps> you're, you're taking, can I, have a, can I have a bite? Show it off. Oh, you're not going to eat, gonna eat, gonna eat, gonna eat gonna it? Gonna eat He's not going to eat it. He's going to nibble. Okay, okay. He's going to nibble. Little bro's taking a nibble. <laughs> nice. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's good. We're, we're making some spice butter beers here today. All right. Okay, so for me, I think that... I'm going to go for one of these, actually. I think this one's wow. your B one, actually. Here. No. Oh, no. wait, Ethan, is that your... That's oh, is that, that's me? Okay, perfect. The Doritos Locos Tacos, they're kind of falling apart, I won't even lie to you, but I'm going to go in with one of the hot sauces, though. Nice. I think I'm going to go for the hot. All right. So I think that my <gasps> favorite, of course, I think honestly, I would like Defense of Dance the Dark Arts or Potions. I just feel like that'd be so cool. Potions is just like a good skill to have. Mm-hmm. It's not flashy. Mm-hmm. I think that Defense Against the Dark Arts would just be cool, you know? You can learn about so many cool things. I feel like I'd be bored. Really? You just, you, you, you learn spells and duel. How is that not, like, how is that not amazing, though? Okay, cats, I make them check. I just want to bite, dude. Man, stealing He ate the entire Doritos logos being talked about. I had, like, one thing today. (laughs) You can have a lettuce, little bro. I also think I would like to learn flying, but I think my favorite 
Oh man, I'm gonna have to go with. Her biology because it's tame. <gasps> oh my gosh, my taco's falling apart. We're good. Go ahead. Her biology is a tame class. Like, if you don't have energy mm-hmm. and you have a bunch of classes ahead of you, her biology's like, oh, you know, I get her biology next. You know, I get to chill. <laughs> Dueling's like, I might break away. I think I wouldn't like her biology because I would kill plants. I'm not good at taking care of plants. I mean, I guess it's useful, but I'm just more for like a defense against the dark arts. Obviously. <laughs> You're Slytherin. <clears throat> no. Trying to perpetuate a stereotype. I am not perpetuating a stereotype of Slytherin. Thank you very much. Oh. All right. Let's continue. What about Harry's class? Hmm. Harry's class. Harry's class? What do you mean? You know, class where you just learn about Harry Potter. <laughs> <laughs> They're like, this dude went here. He's pretty like cool. what? When um, McGonagall. No, 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 what's your name? Pink boy. Mm, the Lowers Umbridge. Yeah. I mean, I wouldn't like that, obviously. No, the class is Harry. Mm. Mm. I don't know. I think, but also potions would be fun because you get to like steal. No, you get to make things. You get to make. So many things and, and potions. Them. No. What do you That's mean, what steal? I would do. Like, you make a potion and he's like, all right, now everyone dump them out. We're not oh, you would just anyone. take it. I'd be like, oh, yeah. mine. <laughs> That's so funny. Yeah. Whichever one. Okay, there we go. Hold on. Mm. Do you want some bites of this one? He's taking the gorgeous. <laughs> Oh my god. He's taking all of Ethan. She's vegetarian. Wait, okay. You break off a piece that you want to eat that you don't eat that you want to eat. Ethan shares these. You should let me know. I would have gotten here some if you Here, I didn't you know. cut this in it. half. And you can have half. Okay. Mm. Which Deathly Hollows would you choose? That's easy what? for me. Preface. Tell them about it. Okay. Deathly Hollows. Mm-hmm. For all There's- you. We got the resurrection stone. Resurrection stone. We got the invisibility cloak. Invisibility cloak. We got the elder wand. Elder wand. Pros and cons of each. Invisibility cloak, you're invisible. You're invisible. All pros, no cons. I don't think there's any cons of being invisible. No, the dude who owned it, the first owner, nothing. I believe their last name was Peveril. Mm -hmm. Read the books. Well, you don't have to read the books. I recommend you read the books. Okay. The books are awesome. And then, Resurrection Stone. Whoever you resurrect... Ultimately becomes sad. And isn't really there. It's like, they, are they... They don't belong there. They're dead. You know? Yeah, that's true. And then the Elder Wand. There are pros and cons to the Elder Wand. It's literally the most powerful wand. In the world. Like, Every, could you imagine having the most powerful wand? It also looks really cool. So many people have died mm-hmm. owning it. Mm-hmm. Because... When you kill a wizard, they're one. Or there's controversy over if you're killing the wizard or if you win a duel mm. with the wizard. Mm-hmm. So, um, to explain that for all you guys who don't know, in order to possess another person's wand, flat out, any wand, not even just the elder wand, you need to win it from them because the wand is allegiance lies with you. And then say, Catherine and I are in a duel. Hey. Say we're in a duel. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, I'm I Harry go, Potter. Expelliarmus. And then, oh no, my wand falls. It's gone. Oh no, now my wand belongs. It belongs to her. I don't wands. have a wand now. That's it. She's got two. Sucks she, up. she got two wands. So that's how it works. Yeah. For the, for the visual learners. Wand so I, several owners of the Elder Wand have died. I don't know which burrito this is. Beef, I'm gonna guess. Oh my god, stop undressing the burrito. <laughs> it's a beef one, I think. It doesn't look very appealing on the inside, but there you go. But I think it's just too risky. I think Dumbledore, no one really knew. He, he wasn't public about the fact that he owned the Elder Wand. And yeah. I think that's smart. If I were to choose the Elder Wand, no one would know. I'd be like, what wand? I don't own a wand. Fun fact about wands. Wizard cloaks have wand pockets. Oh my gosh. Like the ones from Harry <laughs> Potter world? 
want pockets. They like it's ones so you can cool. buy. And grab my water too. You can go ahead. This is my mom's hand. Say hi, mom. Hi. <laughs> We're having a family style meal right now. Mm. So, so what would you choose ultimately? <clears throat> <clears throat> no corona. Don't worry. <laughs> anyway, so. I'm torn I'm, between the invisibility cloak I'm and invisibility the elder one. Cloak. You, you so would. I'm an introvert, so like me you just like watching introvert. people without, like I'm not malicious. Go, you're gonna go people watching. Yeah, but like I always feel weird because like I'm not an old man, mm-hmm. so like I feel like people are like <laughs> worried for me. You know? No. I don't know. I just feel like I feel like a creep, but I'm. I'm not even thinking about that. I'm just like, there, there one goes. Mm. A person. Okay. Well, I feel like I can't choose the same one as you. You can. Mm. It's, it's obviously the best one. It's probably the safest one, too. Mm-hmm. Because, ultimately, I would like to say I want to have the other one, but I feel like, in reality, I would choose the invisibility cloak. Mm-hmm. Because I could, I could do so many things. I could... I would never actually do this. I could go drop a bank. Welcome back. We fixed the camera. All right. So, yeah, I think if because if I had the invisibility cloak, I could just you could steal eavesdrop. from racist companies. That too, but I could I could eavesdrop. You could, and I think that's fun because I love learning things about people <laughs> secretly without their secretly permission. without their permission, like listening. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Well, yeah. Do you want to answer the question too? Oh, definitely the invisibility cloak. Definitely the why? It's the smart choice. <laughs> oh, and Miss we're Ravenclaw over family. here. <laughs> <laughs> Miss Ravenclaw over here is like, I like the invisibility. She's like, why are you guys even thinking about it? Mm-hmm. Ethan, oh my gosh, fellow Slytherin, what about you? He doesn't know. That's okay. All right, next one. Do you want to pick one? Sure. All right. I can you reach like, I would. I would. I could like pick the. Um, the resurrection song just sell to somebody to overpriced. See, that well, is something ethical. I can give you one second to. But it's so, like, did you hear what your son said? He said he would pick the resurrection song to sell it to some poor soul who probably just lost the one to make wants money. to bring Voldemort back. I check it, I'll check him out. Check the backstory out. Alright. Well, yep, there, there it him. goes. So the ring. <laughs> Alright, what's the code's next one? I don't know who that is. Dolores Umbridge. Oh, who is more <laughs> evil, Dolores Umbridge or Voldemort? Bing. That. Dolores. That's easy. They're both really his terrible. Up, his upbringing kind of set him up. He's she from, didn't have the best upbringing either, but not as bad yeah, as Yeah, but she <laughs> didn't really... <laughs> have an excuse not saying Voldemort has an excuse but like <laughs> he's kind of messed up in general like his brain is just wrong well he was born his mom put his dad yeah. under yeah. a love potion and any child don't do it any child born under a love potion will not be able to feel loved yeah. so, don't do that to your future kids so he's at from the beginning right don't Dolores She's kind of, you know, posh. She grew up mm-hmm. in the wizarding world, knowing yeah. her powers. Mm-hmm. And she she's just a terrible person. A terrible person. She didn't like the centaurs. What? It's just like racist. Like it's literally just. I don't know the centaurs. <laughs> you guys gotta show them too. What you made me hungry. Ooh. What are these? Ooh. Okay, so this one is a, it's a rice Ooh. and beef. <laughs> rice and beef burrito mm-hmm. this one's the bean and cheese these are normal tacos they're kind of getting soggy because we're just sitting out so okay. i would but i would eat them now if we eat them okay this one is a doritos, doritos locos taco it's like a cheesy dorito as this shell is it meat is it's meat? meat yeah okay sure. i, I had a it. bite of one i gotta show you <laughs> it is soggy it is really soggy do you want some hot sauce no no all right so where was I? Dolores. Dolores. That pink. Mmm. <laughs> pink girl. 
with the hair. She just had and the cats. Okay, I don't like cats. Sorry, she unpopular didn't even opinion. have like a motivation. Like Dumbledore was like, "Ew, Muggles," you know. Mm-hmm. She was just like, "Everyone, if you convince me to not like him, I won't like him." Mm-hmm. If you got a good argument, sure, I'll mm-hmm. you know kill some kids. Can't really she's a feminist, but it's there. Mm-hmm. Going in for another one. I think Hufflepuff likes sugar. Voldemort is inherently more evil. Dolores is no. a bad person. I don't know if Dolores yeah. has actually killed people, you know? She's a bad person, though. I'm sure Just she has it. had people who killed people, if you know what I mean. Well, and I think mm. she doesn't... She's a follower. She she mm-hmm. follows power. Mm-hmm. He's a leader and she's a follower. That's a very interesting concept. Hmm. Well, I guess we could go with Voldemort. I would say Voldemort then. After hearing that argument, I would definitely say Voldemort. Nah, I'm gonna go with... Okay, Dolores is pretty bad, though. She is... She has... No right. She has no right? No right. Like, he's... Voldemort... There was no way he you was going like, to You're, like, giving him the, the, the pass, the green the green. Card. Okay, yeah, because everyone's like, oh, if he just was different in school, like, if people were nice to him, he'd be good. No, I he wouldn't. I don't know. No, he I don't wouldn't. Think so, yeah. If Dolores was raised as, like, a... Like a Harry. If she mm. was raised like Harry, mm. she may have been different. Mm. You know? But she mm-hmm. chose not to. Is that your answer then? Yes. Okay. How about you? I think Dumbledore mm. is inherently evil. Dumbledore. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe I had a little rum in my butt of you. <laughs> <laughs> I think Voldemort is inherently evil. Mm-hmm. And Dolores is a bad person. I don't know. It's a tough one. It is a tough one. It's a one. tough one. And what do you think? We want to go for the fire one. Fear! <sighs> okay, yeah, Ethan, what do you think? I would say just like um, Dolores Umbridge. Because it's like. Well, yeah, because it's like Voldemort just has. He's just had like a terrible upbringing. Dang, and... they're all about the terrible upbringing. Like, well, yeah, also, but it's also the th- the fact that he's like mm. doing it for something he thinks of. Dolores is just bad. Mm. Just like, yeah, she doesn't care what it's about. She mm-hmm. just wants power, and mm-hmm. I think that's more corrupted. Mm-hmm. Like, the Voldemort's way worse than like people, he he's but... corrupted because of his ideas. Like, you know, he just got so into it that he he lost himself. Dolores, knowing, but does... I mean what she does defense when tom riddle aka voldemort for all you people who don't know tom marvolo riddle oh anyway when he was at the orphanage he would torture his fellow people his fellow orphanage children (laughs) 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 he would though like he had a box full of keepsakes of like that's terrible Right? He's he's evil. He's he evil. Is evil incarnate. Okay, they're both evil. They're, okay, both, they're both bad. Evil. But they're I'm to, sticking with my answer. And I'm sticking with my answer. Well, I mean, Dolores also random question. Closer, I don't know if it's in the cup. If it is, we can just throw it. it was, hi, Asia. What's up? Hi, Asia. Um, <laughs> if you could own as a muggle. Okay, even though we're not. <laughs> If you could own a magical creature, mm. what would it be? It's a toughie. A hippogriff. A hippogriff. I want to fly. That is a big animal. Oh, yeah. I love big animals. Sorry. There's a barking chihuahua. He's an angry old man. He is. Like Voldemort. He can't go up. He's stuck in the garage. Mm-hmm. But anyway. A hippogriff, no, because hippogriffs are big. They have wings. They're birds. You, okay. Is it a horse? Is okay. it a bird? Okay, you're a muggle. People are gonna be suspicious if there's like an eleven if- foot animal in your backyard. What if I live on a farm? Someone's gonna find you. Sightings of a bird. Do you have the resources to take care of that animal? Yes. In the wizarding world. But you're, but in in this scenario, you have no access to that. Like you just get a letter from Dumbledore. 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 <laughs> from Dumbledore. No, from like Newt's grandson, right? Uh-huh. And and they're like, 
<laughs> and he's just like, yo, don't tell anyone. But I got this for you. Here you go. I still want a hippo. I have a love for pygmy puffs. There's my boyfriend. <laughs> they eat your earwax. Fred! They're just weird, and you can you can put them in your pocket, you know? Mm-hmm. The, those are larger. Yeah, larger that's fair. Than. But I don't know. I want, I want a Thunderbird. You want a Thunderbird. Even oh. bigger. Let's get bigger. <laughs> <laughs> Let's get bigger oh, see, no, and better. That's the thing. It'd be like a cat. I'd just like, be with it for night. Yeah. And that's it. Yeah, or just let it go. Mm-hmm. You just help, have it for a night and be like, peace. Really? No, no. I let, her, I let her go at day, and mm-hmm. then she'll come back at night. And mm-hmm. she's like, I'll just like, I have I an outdoor know. Thunderbird. <laughs> Not an indoor. An outdoor dog, an outdoor Thunderbird. Also, you can just like, make it rain whenever. Just a suitcase. That's new suitcase. We wouldn't get that. Different. Well, it's not. It's not. Oh my gosh. Also, it's just the suitcase. what are the suitcase. those? They're like the moon kip or something. Oh, the, the moon kip. I don't know if that's the correct name. Oh, the they're the ones that their eyes are like constantly glued up to the moon. Oh, they can't move yeah, their... they're like this. Yeah, and then they eat the floating food and they're like. Bah, 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 bah. Those, those are, just are cute. really cute. Yeah. But yeah. No, or, I get a Thunderbird. Or I'd want to try and. Or I'd want to like a giant pool and get one of those seahorse things. Oh, and, yeah. Uh, those ooh, big. Ooh, I don't know what they're called. Ooh. Which one are you going to do? The big in Fantastic Beasts and Where to Find Them too. It's seaweed horse. Thing. It's like a big seaweed horse. Oh, the problem. kelpie. Kelpie. Yeah, thank yeah. You, the kelpie. It's kelp, guys, not seaweed. Anyway, all right. Next one. Wait, what would you pick? I would pick those birds that make four boob shells. Oh my gosh! <laughs> You're <laughs> such a Ravenclaw right now. You're like. It's silver, guys. And then, and then, mm-hmm. Wait, Mom, then, you, then can... you could take the money from the shells and you could help so many animals. You could buy a well, new she suitcase. makes oh me gosh. feel bad now okay, about yeah, no, my, you're my hypocrite. <laughs> right, right, you're a muggle. Right. Right. right, but... Also, are you going to breed the worm? Are you going to breed the bird worms? Why would we there? breed them? So she can get the silver casing. Well, if, just they, fall one, one, if they fall in love. If they know. fall in love, it happens, it happens. But technically, yeah. they don't you only get You only get one silver casing. All right, moving on. Moving on. Moving on. Next one. So the efficient way of income is breeding them. Okay. All right. Okay. Moving on. You can also sell the birds for more income. <laughs> okay, which death is the most heartbreaking? Don't you know, you know Let's yours. list them all. I don't even Spoiler have to. Spoiler alert. I don't have to. And we know your answer. I know. Go ahead. You can say it. Snake. <laughs> but I always knew he was good. I always knew. Yeah, did you? I did. <laughs> Through the whole book, I knew. We read the books together. And Abby didn't. It was mean. <laughs> okay, but it was so we were watching Chamber of Secrets yesterday, and when he just like, when everyone's like, troll in. Oh, wait. <laughs> troll in the dungeon? Wait, what were we watching? Troll. No, it was the first one. It was the first one. It was two days ago. Mm-hmm. And, and there's a troll in the dungeon. Thank you, Patrick. That's actually. That is the first one. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I'm terrible. Yes, continue. And, um,. Everyone leaves, and then Snape, like, dramatically looks at the camera and goes back a secret door, and you're like, ooh, he's evil, but no, he's going to, to see say if the, to, the stone's To make there. sure the stone's safe, And, yeah. like, what a cutie. Because he's Snape. The best person. But yeah, okay, so let's list people who've died. Snape. <laughs> Dobby. Oh, my God. Snape. Oh, Dobby. Do- oh. Oh, one, one. Oh, Lavender. Lavender Brown. I just, I don't like her, but I felt so bad about no, how she that, went. It's, yeah. It's really tragic. Cedric. Ugh. Oh, Cedric. Serious. Serious. Fred. It's just awful. Tonks and Lupin. Oh my god. Right after that they had was a baby. Bad. That was bad. Can we talk about Molly killing Bellatrix, though? Oh, wow. Oh, 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 yeah. Not my daughter, you. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that was oh, also Hedwig. very tragic. We just watched that again recently. Oh man, okay, Hedwig. but the one that always makes me cry is Dobby's. Dumbledore, how do we bring it? Dumbledore, Dumbledore, we knew it was gonna happen. He was, he, was kind of a weird. he just knew. He is kind of heartless. Was he really died too? Because he's in the picture after. Doesn't he get in the picture eventually? What? what? You know when they die, they end up in the pictures, the paintings. Oh yeah, the paintings, and they—it's the memory of them though. Like mm-hmm. they can still the memory, but mm-hmm. he, his mind is either. He's dead. I mean, he talked to Harry down in the in between. Down in, in the in between. Maybe he's like 
in the in between them. Maybe you can take a train to the that in was between. Dream. On. Anyways. But really, it had to be the same. What was that? Dobby <laughs> makes you cry. It's getting harder. No, no Dobby's, Dobby's makes you I cry. Don't know. Snape makes me cry. The most. I love Snape. Dobby. Oh, okay, yeah, but when he's like, take them, and the, the, the tear, tear, and he's just and he was, so he's like, like, he's like, please he's take like, them. Yes. Oh, I know. But Dobby's like. Dobby's happy to be with his friend. And then Luna, my lovely, lovely She closes lady. his eyes. Now we can be sleeping. Now we can be sleeping. I feel like top top two, Dobby and Snape. But also, Fred. Come on. Because George is okay, the one who gets serious. Sirius is like oh, the serious. first, like, oh, poop one. Sirius is yeah. the first heartbreak. Harry finally found out he, finds out he has a family member. His godfather, who's best be- friend with this beautiful dead cat. man, beautiful man, yeah, stylish, swanky, lovely locks, yep, yep, and then he dies, and then he dies, <laughs> and he, oh, and he's with freaking, freaking. I mean, Bobby. of course, his parents are dead, but they, I don't, in. James can get out. He was mean. And then, he, what about Mad Eye? Ah, uh, because um, you don't see it, but you know it. I just feel like he Gosh. definitely went cuckoo, but he he cared. You know, he cared he, for he the did greater a lot good. Of good in, yeah. in his life. Yeah. <laughs> um, but I, I have to Snape and Dobby. Oh my god, I don't think so. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Next question. Wait, 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 we need to decide. So yours is Snape. It's What's just yours? always Snape for me because I love him. Because <laughs> I love him. I loved him in the book. I loved him in the movie. Oh, Alan Rickman. Perfectly cast. As Perfect. Alan Rickman. Rest, the entire rest series. Rest in peace. I know. Mm-hmm. Rest in peace, Alan Rickman. Rest in peace. Because we love him too. His voice is beautiful. <laughs> I know. So, so you're... It's a you're sad hour. <laughs> your top one? My man Dobby. Yeah. Aw, Dobby. He... All he has ever done is look out for Harry. All I he ever know. cared about was Harry. And why, why did he care about Harry? Okay, but... Because he saved him. Because he, he cared about him. good. He cared about oh. the good. Oh, get him. Preach, mommy. <laughs> he cared about And why? And why? Because. <laughs> okay, but also, what did Snape do his entire life? Cared, cared about Harry. Because he cared about good. Good. Yeah. I know both. Even of though them. he used to be Death Eater, it's like you know, doesn't just, matter your past, you can change. You're even better if you re- if you're brought up in that environment and then you you, you still realize. Yeah, Dumbledore has a hard past too. We won't get into Dumbledore's past today. All Next right. question. All right. All right. What character are you most like? <sighs> you're Harry, dude. What? Because you're emotional what? and angsty. What? Mm. <laughs> And the center of attention. <laughs> At least tries to be. Ooh, thick yeah, burn, shouldn't, bro. Shouldn't, shouldn't say tries to be. I enjoys don't try being. To be. The enjoys center. being the center. That of makes attention. me sound like a terrible. And <laughs> no, <laughs> that's not wrong. That's you enjoy it. You like a, a ten- well. You I like also affection. like to help others no matter what, which is something Harry is. Fights for the greater yeah, but good. Yeah, I, I think the 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 Anxious. is where I see. The well, most. I mean. Consider, look at Harry's life. He has a right to be angsty. Well, I know, but like, it's just in his, his persona. And mm-hmm. it's, it's in yours. yours I still think you're Luna. I will take that happily and skip away into the sunset. <laughs> <laughs> and yeah, love. 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 McGonagall. Yeah. Yeah. She, My mom she's, is from She's loving and scary at some time. Is she a little bit of a bitch? <laughs> Which she needs to be. Yes. Pull out the, <laughs> <laughs> the B card. Ethan, what do we decide? We were talking recently about this. Mm-hmm. And I don't think we decided on one. He should be Harry Potter. No. No. Well, he's pretty he's, angsty sometimes. Yeah, <laughs> but if, if, if he were in Harry's position, he'd be like, all right, kill myself. Like, that's the only thing we can do. <laughs> or like, in the beginning, they would have been like, this is your destiny. He would have been like, fuck that. <laughs> Like, nah, no thanks. Mm-hmm. Choose someone else. Well, he's independent. Mm-hmm. He, mm-hmm. You you like to be a loner, so that kind of fits Harry. Maybe you're Draco Malfoy. 
No. No. Jacob's too like trying to please people too much. His parents. He's, he, he's like he's like maybe Dean, he's I'm Dean Jacob Thomas. <laughs> Dean Thomas, because you know he just kind of like hangs out. He stays out of trouble. What's he? He is Hermione. You no. always correct me okay, every but, single uh, sentence. Her, 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 Hermione like goes out of her way to chase after people to make sure that they're doing the right thing. Like she That's will stop it nothing. <laughs> this is hard. Oh my gosh. Mad eye. Oh, oh you're mad eye. He's totally mad eye. Absolutely. Mad-eye. He's totally mad eye. All right, be warned, it might taste like Dublin piss. <laughs> Tastes like goblin fish. You sure? Cut this for you. See what's inside of it. Oh, thank, thank you. you. Such a mom. Such a mom. Such a McGonagall. Oops, I took. Oh no, I took one. A standard. Oh, what Quidditch position <laughs> would you play? Ding. Oh, is it bean and rice? Yeah, it's bean and rice. Okay, I guess I'll eat it even though. I'm gonna careful. reach over for a mild. For the, the mukbang. For the greater good. For the greater good. What Quidditch position would you play? Luna in the lion hat on the sideline. So you wouldn't play Quidditch. I don't know. I would like to hit bludgers. <laughs> like, you don't really have to worry about anything. Just be like, I got you, bro. You yeah. Know? Uh-huh. I'd like to Wait, do that. Yeah, but the, the bludgers will come. So they're a beater. The bludgers would come for you. He is right. But, like, it's just... But you have a bat. Solo baseball. Okay. Solo baseball. Oh, my God. Oh, no, I dropped one in the nachos. I'm going to put it back. Put it back. Mm-hmm. All right. Okay, I think I would in like to say I'd be the seeker. You're too... Uh, whoa. Aggressive. Ooh. Are you not saying too... There's cheese in there. No, yeah, look. Right so, you'd be like Shunter. Look at that. Ooh, look at that mm-hmm. che- Oh, that looks really good. You'd be like Shunter. Right? I'd be Shunter. Sen- well, in the... That's not a position. Like, like with a quaffle. You yeah. play, you, you play, I mean, when I did the cross, I was defense. I would want to be a seeker, though. I like to think I can see things pretty well. I would like to beg to differ. <laughs> you have ADHD. So. so, I don't see that going well. Well, then maybe... I wouldn't want to be the being... keeper. I would not want to be the keeper, that's for sure. Maybe I would be center, Ethan. Maybe you're You'd right. You'd be a beater. I don't think I'd be a well. You'd make a fair beater. I'd make a fair beater. I would. I'd be a pretty good beater. Hmm. How about you, mom? I don't know. I like Ethan, you'd be a keeper. I guess you'd be. I could see Ethan definitely being a keeper. Ethan, would you get me some water, love? Can I get kiss mm. her? <sighs> All right. Last question. Beautiful. Oh, two oh, more. Two more. Okay. <clears throat> oh, favorite character and why? Luna. Because she... Oh, Luna's relationship with Harry. It's so pure. Is, it's so needed it really for him. Is. She's there for him without, her, without, question. without being involved directly with his issues. So, like, with Hermione mm-hmm. and Ron, he's always having kind of, like, turbulence because they're working together, and that's hard. Yeah. But Luna's just there for support. And she's there to relate to him mm-hmm. because she also lost her mother. That is true. And she oh, makes him feel so normal she can, because her and she's Harry, so weird. Her and Harry can see the Thestrals. Yeah. Okay, so for those of you who don't know, Thestrals are creatures that kind of look like really bony greyhounds. <laughs> that are horse-sized. That with, are horse-sized with, with wings. wings. <laughs> and you can only see them if you've seen death. It's very sad. But, but they're beautiful. They are. Luna... I saw like her mom she, die. That's horrible. First she of all. helps Harry through his depressive years. Yeah, she's she was his Ron date to Hermione, Slughorn's party. Yeah, like she's always there for him mm-hmm. when he just needs a friend, and so yeah. is Hermione. Mm-hmm. But her, he, whenever he's with her, he's probably reminded of what they have to do. You know, mm-hmm. with Luna, he can just detox. But you know who's always there for Harry? Harry Snape. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Harry's never there for Harry. Harry needs Harry. <laughs> Um, we sent him the the sword. Oh, I know. Just saying. <laughs> this pivotal to pivotal turning point to killing the horror cryptids. Yes, just saying. But Ron saved Harry. That's true. Because Harry, there's so many, so many. In, like, I hope you guys have seen the movies because, or else you will not understand most of our conversation. I'm sure they are. 
Wait, no, some people don't. I don't know it. Okay. Well, don't worry. Some I people plan have on fixing life that. deprivation <laughs> from <laughs> Harry Potter. From Harry Potter. You know what yeah. Ethan said earlier? I don't know why you guys are so obsessed. Like, I like it, but. Are you guys I'm not obsessed. Really? Really? You're not my son. Not my son. I'm not. I think it. my favorite character. Draco. Oh, yeah, totally was Draco. I she was had totally a mad Draco. crush on Draco. I had a mad crush so on Draco. Cool. We already we touched on this earlier, actually. Okay. But I have to say Draco. I I, I just love his backstory. It was so edgy. <laughs> Second favorite. Molly. Lupin. Oh, Molly kicks ass. Oh, Molly's awesome. Molly Weasley hit Ron's Molly's mother. like the super mom. She's the mom. She lost the a brother mom. in the first great war against Voldemort. Oh my god, I did not know that. You didn't know that? I did not know her, that. Both her brothers actually oh, died in the war. Oh my goodness. Mm -hmm. Mom. Oh wait. Snape. Favorite? Oh, Snape. Snape. Yeah. Snape. I love Snape. I just love him. I die for Snape. I do anything. I would do anything for Snape. Because he basically did anything for the cause that and for Harry. True. Ethan? Um, for me, it's like a tie between, um... Yeah. Get into it. I think mine would be serious. Um... <laughs> Very cute. Very wholesome. <clears throat> Very good. So dumb. <laughs> because, yo, he can turn into a woof woof. Honestly, the only... The only part of the Marauders... Mm -hmm. Who I like. I don't like James. Lupin. Oh my god, I'm so dumb. Yeah. Forgot that Lupin was Lupin in had a crazy childhood too. He, because of what his. Okay, real quick, real quick. His father worked at the Ministry of Magic hunting werewolves who were bad. Oh. And he put Fenrir Greyback, who's a notorious werewolf who would kill so many women. He put him on trial saying he's a werewolf, but he was saying, Fenir's like, no, I'm not a werewolf, whatever. They released him. Fenir wanted to get revenge on Lupin's dad, so he almost killed Lupin, but instead turned him into a werewolf. Oh. So he had to witness his son turning into a werewolf every full moon. Daddy, I didn't know. That's why there's a Whomping Willow at Hogwarts, too. Yeah. It's there because of that? It, Dumbledore it protects... planted it. Because they, they could go their little secret passageway, secret way, passage and then to it protects the him when shack. he's like that. Um, so people can't follow him I and hurt him. I remember that part. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. Time to reread the books. Last one. I was also going to either say, um... God, this is awesome. <laughs> 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 take your time. Take your time, take your time. Gabby, you're letting me oh, down here with the eating. Long, I long bottom. We gotta I'm we full. gotta condition her for long bottom. Long bottom. <laughs> long bottom is lovely. Oh, oh Neville. Neville long bottom. Neville. They long really bottom. tried to make him not hot, but that that bitch got hot. He did. He did. <laughs> not as hot as Snape, but oh my god. Snape's really good. Snape's hair in the oh. sixth movie. Yeah. Lovely. Snape in the first movie. I forgot what the last one was. Snape is Snape. Oh, the most simple question. What house are you in? Um, I don't know what house I'm in. It's really not on I'm wearing a child's shirt. That's that Asian shit. <laughs> Obviously, I'm Slytherin. I am a Hufflepuff. Yeah, she's uh, a Hufflepuff. proud Hufflepuff. Yep, she's a proud Hufflepuff. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Everyone thinks Hufflepuffs are all, like, all of them are like, wow. I could tell you, I don't like a good, uh, well, I don't like mean people, and a lot of people are mean. They're I don't like a lot of people. And Hufflepuffs are just, like, I'm, they're just, they're just taking care of themselves. They are. You know why you're I a Slytherin? Not. I hope not, too. I hope I'm not Voldemort. You, you seek the spook. I seek the spook. I do seek the spook. I don't I seek He spook. is a Slytherin because he's, he's, he's a Slytherin. He's like a Slytherin. You know what like, I'm talking about? He's he like, he full on. Don't bother me, I'm in my cave. I don't bother me, I'm But we still love him. I love you. Slytherins and Hufflepuffs have like a... Everyone who's not a Gryffindor, we love each other. Yeah. Mother? Ravenclaw. Yeah, Ravenclaw. she's Ravenclaw. Um. <laughs> <laughs>
goes for the underwater now. <laughs> yes, my boyfriend is also a Ravenclaw. <sighs> well, well, I'd say I think we did pretty well. It's your first one. Yeah, so. I think I think it went pretty well. I don't know if whoever's However, watching, if anyone watches help. this, what do you think? About Harry Potter in general. Answer these questions yourself. I would love to know the answers. I am very into Harry Potter, so tell me. What house are you in? Who's your favorite character? And do you love Snape? And do you <laughs> love Snape? Let me know what you want to see. I'll talk about anything. most things. Anything. You she like you like anything. nerd movies? I like nerd movies. You like anime? I like anime. You like dogs? I got six. All right. We'll see you later. <laughs> Bye.